WhatsApp is one of the most popular instant messaging app available on the planet and it's available for most of the devices. But if you try to install WhatsApp on iPad, you will first go to App Store and search for WhatsApp in the App Store. But as soon as you tap search, you will notice that there are many WhatsApp clone or similar apps that pretend to be WhatsApp but actually they are not. So you can't install WhatsApp on iPad. But wait, there is a workaround and in this video, we will learn how to get WhatsApp on iPad. Hey everyone, Rahul here from TechRepro and welcome back to another episode where I'll guide you how to get WhatsApp on iPad. And if you are new here, this channel is all about tech hacks, tips, tricks, tutorials and reviews. So make sure to subscribe to TechRepro channel and tap on the bell icon so that you never miss an important update. Before I show you how to install WhatsApp on iPad, let me tell you. WhatsApp already has a web version which you can access simply by opening Safari or any other web browser and then typing web.whatsapp.com in the URL field. But when we visit web.whatsapp.com, it shows us these options. If you carefully look at this, you will notice that there is no iPad here, which means WhatsApp doesn't allow you to use its web version on iPad. So in order to get WhatsApp web on iPad, we need to tap the share button. And then from where sharing options, choose to request desktop site. Alright, the QR code is generated and now we need to scan this from our another device. So open WhatsApp on your another device and tap 3 dot menu. Then WhatsApp web. It's pretty quick and now WhatsApp is mirrored on my iPad. So that is how you can get WhatsApp on your iPad. But there is a downside to this. If you exit the browser, you don't get notifications. However, I have a solution for that as well. And here comes the best part how to install WhatsApp on iPad. So keep watching. Simply go to App Store and type Messenger for WhatsApp. As soon as you tap on the search button, you will see various apps. This one and this one works great, but I would recommend you to install Messenger for WhatsApp. This one, because that's the only one with push notifications. Once installed, open the app and scan the QR code. And that's it. You can use WhatsApp on iPad. However, you will encounter some ads as well, which you can ignore or choose to remove ads if you like to pay premium fee. But apart from the ads, this works fine as a substitute for WhatsApp on iPad. So that is how you can get WhatsApp on your iPad. If you encounter any problem, let me know in the comments below and I'll be happy to help. You may also check out the description below to read an article on our blog for more information. If you enjoyed watching this video, please hit the like button and share with your friends. Thanks for watching, I'm Rahul signing off and I'll see you in the next video.